<laughs> hey guys, it's Hague here, and on this video, I'm going to show you how to tell if your computer is infected with malware. This is probably a very simple way of finding out if you're infected with malware. Now, I purposely infected this computer, this VM computer, but I'm going to show you what you guys can do to figure out if you're infected. I mean, this is just one way. There's many ways, but this is probably the most easiest way to to right off the bat know if you're infected with malware or not. And you can probably tell already if you're smart enough by looking at the desktop of this virtual computer that we're already infected with potentially unwanted software you don't need. But for the other users that don't know much about identifying malware, this video is for you. Let's jump right into this VM computer here. All right, so we'll say we don't know much. I can tell already that this is infected just by looking at the desktop by some of the softwares that are installed in these pops that we're getting down here. But for some users, they may not think that they're infected at this stage. So if you want to know if you're infected with malware, what you want to do is you want to open up your browser. I want to do a search for something called Process Explorer. All right. You're going to get it from uh, TechNet. Or, and we're going to... Uh, Click on the link and we're going to go ahead and proceed to download Process Explorer. I hope if I get to the right website. Alright, so we're going to download Process Explorer. Alright, we'll, we'll download it it's, uh, using Google Chrome. Um, we're going to just uh, click on uh, Open it. We'll extract the files. This is Process Explorer. So we're looking for the Process Explorer file right here. Process X right here. And we're just going to run. go ahead and run the file and click and then click Run. We'll click Agree. And there's Process Explorer installed on the system. All right. So here's what Process Explorer looks like, and it's probably really impossible for a person to know if they're infected by looking at Process Explorer, just like this. All right, so make it full screen. All right, once you make it full screen at the very, very top, actually under Options, you're going to click Options. We're going to come down to Virus Total. We're going to see this box, Check Virus Total. And every process that's on your computer, we're about to get it scanned for 50. 51 antivirus vendors, any processes that are in that are running. So it's going to pop up saying you must agree to the terms. Just click yes, and it's going to say right here on where my mouse is hash it submitted. So it's be all the processes on your computer in the background are being uploaded to Virus Total, being scanned with several different antivirus softwares. All right, what you're looking for is one out of 62, two out of 54, and they light they light up red for you. So um. When you see these processes that are lighted up red, there's a chance that these files are uh, malicious. The higher the number, the worse it is. So we can take a look at these files, and if you do a right-click on it, and you right-click on these processes, and you click check virus total, it's going to scan it. And yes, yeah, so there many of vendors have. Uh, Called this on say file. I think if you click on these results, it, if it works correctly, it up takes you to Virus Total's website here, and you can see here that it's a Trojan horse. All right. Now the key details to tell if you're infected is taking a look under this Virus Total tab. If it lights up red, those are likely infected. All right. There are files that are currently running on your system that's malware. If you don't see these on your computer, you're not. You may not be infected. It's right away. This is just identifying that your computer is infected. You can already see here on this computer that there, there's pop-ups right here. Telltale sign you're infected. In some cases you don't even have pop-ups to go by. So using this software, you can tell right away if you're infected. So then you want to uh, kill these processes and run antivirus scanners. And if you're infected, check my video on how to remove malware in the description box of this video and follow the procedure there to uninfect your computer. I hope this video helped the uh, users learn if they're infected or not.